Security took an extra few minutes because they wanted to look at the snacks in my backpack. And the person next to me had a candle in their bag and they had to bring an explosives specialist to check out the candle. <sighs> but we made it. back at the bus stop where I just got dropped off a little bit ago. Uh, my Airbnb is just a couple blocks down the street here and I'm gonna go into town to check out a market, try to get a little something to eat and maybe some stuff for the next couple days. Um, yeah, I took a shower, feel a lot more awake now, still a little like, what day is it? Like a little confused, but I don't feel too bad. I luckily slept really well, not really well. I slept a lot on the plane. Right, the rain turned into more of a light mist, so I decided to walk a bit, maybe down to the next bus stop or something, but I'm really enjoying seeing all of the plants here and everyone's yards and the flowers. It's kind of hard to wrap my mind around the fact that I'm in spring now, so there are flowers blooming and it feels a bit odd, but it's, it's really lovely and there's so many different plants and also already a couple birds that I've never seen before, so very excited to learn about the flora and fauna here. Also, I'm walking by a really beautiful cemetery. are still really swollen from the long plane trip. So I'm doing some legs up the wall to try and help. around a little bit and decided to get some vegetable buns for lunch. So I'm gonna go maybe over to the park and find the spot to eat.
yesterday I was thinking that today would be my beach day, but it's actually quite windy most of the day today. It's still a bit breezy, but I got some work done on the computer, applied for some jobs, things like that, but um, it's about noon now and I'm ready to get out of the house and stretch my legs a little, so I'm going for a little walk around the neighborhood. <laughs> 